So, here we have the, the, the Motoroid. This is the tablet variant of Droid. Um, again, what we have is a beautiful 3.7 inch color display on there, which is um, running a native DVD or 854 by 480 resolution. We have fully customizable home screen where we can add or remove widgets onto the home screen. It's got the calendar on there, position. Very, very slim form factor with 8 megapixel imager. Large autofocus, high quality imager oh, yeah. and the Xenon flash. The device is capable of shooting video. Um, we'll just quickly load up the video settings on here. There we go. Oh well, let's have a look, shall we? We'll go settings. So we have. Video resolution. Oops, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Video resolution. We have standard definition of 720 by 480. We have VGA, or alternatively, we can put in high def at 720p. Okay. So we can select that at high definition video. That's as much or as little as you like. Um, yeah, what of course we can. resolution in the Android. Exactly. It's an absolutely magnificent device. So here we go, and oh, we can give us a nice smile. Yeah. There. Are you going to give us a nice smile? Mm. There we go. See? Mm. Very good. It's an HDMI yeah. port, so we can actually plop that straight into your high definition very television. Popular. So there we have the Motoroid, and doing very, very well for us in Korea at the moment. It actually has a digital satellite and digital terrestrial receiver. Okay. Uh, built into it, so you can watch TV. You have a little TV light okay. which comes on there. Um, whilst you're sitting on the train or on the bus or by your desk, you know. What is? Ah, okay. Okay. Perfect. What we have is is the stylus. The stylus doubles up um, as a stand. Imagine the nightmare scenario happens. You're in the ball game. You know, you're watching football, and a telephone call comes in. Yep. The personal video recorder will start recording your television exactly the moment that the, yeah. the telephone call like comes in. Okay, just like you would at home. So it will time shift like pay -per -view. your TV. Exactly, like pay-per-view. And, and then you can carry on watching exactly when you left Only off. digital broadcast. Digital, correct, yeah. So that's, um, that's the MT710. It's a lovely form factor, on this rem reminiscent of a book, beautifully finished. And um, as I say, available in China right now okay. okay so then we wanted to have a quick look at the quench i believe and i'm hoping somebody's not run off with my quench but, oh actually you know what you might like this <laughs> yeah, run out of DVDs, but i can give you a phone if you need you know? <laughs> i've got one which does high depth yeah. all right well I, i'm not going to comment on the android version but here's what i want to show you what i want to show you is something which is a bit fun okay this phone here this is Droid version. This is Droid, okay. okay. So this is Droid. The Adobe, my friends at Adobe dropped this yeah. round to me and yesterday. Flash 10.1. And here you're watching Flash 10.1 inline video. Okay, wonderful. Which will automatically resize again, just the same way, sorry, just the same way as it would work at home on your computer. You double tap. You go to full screen, you double tap, come back. Okay. Yeah. Flash 10.1 doesn't just have to be inline video. What we also have is... Put your hand down. <laughs> what you also have is um, all of the options for uh, games. So we're going to play Celebrity Guess Who, because I need to practice. I'm not very good at this. So <laughs> Celebrity Guess Who, here we go. Let's put it over here. I need you behind me, guys. I need your help on this. So here we go. We're going to play the game of Celebrity... Okay. Somebody ran off with a. Did you steal my friend? Yes. Okay. Yeah. All right. And now, so. Um, this is the new product. This is a new product. We released Quench yesterday morning. Now, Quench comes with Moto Blur. Moto Blur is um, Moto Blur is a service which. Um, First and only service to synchronize all of your contacts, your pictures, your messages, your tweets, um, automatically. From 
all of your favorite social networking space. So when you buy a motor load device, the first screen you get is this screen. And quite literally, you just select which of your services you have, and um, you enter in for the first and last time your your login and your password. That's the first and last time you ever have to do okay. it. Okay. What motor blur servers then do is to talk to these different accounts. They'll pull out all of your messages, all of your pictures, all of your uh, you know all of your contacts, and and then it will work to deliver them automatically over the air via a cloud onto the home screen of your device. There are no apps to open, okay? okay? It's just delivered onto the home screen. You don't have a Facebook app, you don't have a Twitter app. It's just integrated into the device. So here we have Connie, okay? okay. Connie Heiss has um, just given a quick update. Um, another update, <laughs> Vicky Heiss, her sister, Missy Rubel. You can see here any comments which have been made or we can make a comment on that. Now, in Facebook. Yeah. You also optical notice pad. it's not an optical pad, it's the same as a mouse pad technology, okay. okay, that we've integrated here and you can scroll. Okay, yeah. yeah. I hear. The other nice thing that we have, perhaps we do add a comment. Now, what we wanted to do on a touch device is to provide people the best in class user experience, okay, with entering text. So many people have predictive text. We integrated swipe technology, which is absolutely absolutely super. So let's say hi. Yeah. Connie, C O N I E. And there's the first the Android phone with. <laughs> it hasn't picked up Connie, there we go. Uh, keyboard. Yes, that's in the correct. Market. And yep. it's deep integrated into the device. I mean, this isn't an application. You know, it's, and it's a very efficient, very fast way of entering. The other nice thing that we've actually integrated on here. You saw some Flash 10, but we've actually integrated Flash Lite onto this device. So Flash Lite is, it doesn't have the full functionality of Flash 10, but it can really bring to life things like, you know, your, your, um, and, uh, your Flash movies. This is the big chill in 30 seconds, which we're taking a look at here. And again, the speed and fluidity of what we call a connected media player. Now, the connected media player incorporates the radio, music videos, news, a community, and song ID, all within one app. So if we take a look at the videos, we have maybe YouTube search music videos or Go channels. So we'll have a quick look on here. And I see, I'll pick the last one, which was Hip Hop Official. Because I can see, you know, you're clearly a hip hop fan. Yeah, no, of clearly. Course, yeah. So, okay, we've got Big Sean <laughs> here. Big Sean is the artist of the week. So let's see what old Big Sean has got to say. Okay, here we go. Now, here, this is live demo. I hope it works. And it's. You already know what it is, man. Go. Big Sean, good music, finally famous. And I'm Hip Hop Officials Artist so again, of the Week. It, it really I tune in, the, man. The yes, sir. <laughs> On the, in terms of the ID, what we have is a very, very thin form factor. We've got our micro SD here, the 5 megapixel imager with LED flash. And on the very top, of course, we carry the 3.5 mil headset check. And uh, what about RAM processor? Remember? Again, can I suggest okay. you just and check on... Motor Blur, RAM yes. on Cupcake, I think, or is already part This will be 1.6. Okay, uh, okay 1.6. Yeah, okay. Android 1.6. Uh, maybe later. Mm -hmm. Can be up. Maybe later. <laughs>